everybody, this is Kiefer with DangerouslyHardcore.com and I wanted to address the question of what's, how important is the protein to fat ratio in your ultra low carb meals. Uh, to be honest, it's pretty important, but what's important is making sure that you get enough fat in those meals that you trigger fat burning instead of slowing it down with too much protein. Um, this actually doesn't take a lot, uh, half a gram of fat for every gram of protein, and then you can go up and above that. Uh, otherwise, it's very simple. And the way I usually address it is to eat just fattier cuts of meat. So for example, beef at 80-20 uh, beef or 90-10, those both work really well. With uh, fish, I love salmon, and if I'm gonna have a white fish that's traditionally low in fat, then I'll pretty much fry it up in butter or coconut oil, which gives it a really unique flavor uh, that I enjoy. So those are just some ways that you can compensate and add fat. Another is with your protein shakes, if, if you're using those to augment your meals, is to add coconut oil to those. I don't recommend relying on protein shakes too often because they will create an amino acid spike which can help growth, but they don't help fuel that growth for the next 24 hours. It's been shown that eating whole foods like meats, cheeses, cottage cheese is a good one, they will actually increase muscle growth, so protein synthesis, over the next 24 hours. Protein shakes don't do so well. And in a weight loss scenario, the whole foods actually help you preserve far more muscle tissue than trying to rely on protein shakes. All right, that's another tip, dangerouslyhardcore.com.